Hello everybody and welcome to my tutorial today on how to cut out shapes on your image for drop mock or to cut out a shape of a green screen to use in your drop mock for video. The following is a website called Cut My Pick and it's free and you come here and you can simply click on to upload an image. So in this case, you can see here how I cut out a circle, and I had people asking me how I done that, so I wanted to share this with you today. So I'm going to click on this image here, and I'm going to click to open it. And then I'm going to click to go. When the image opens, give the page a second or two to load. And then you'll see here, you can round the corners of your picture, or you can create a shadow effect on your image. So just to start off to show you, you can drag the round corners, or you could even actually come to make it a full round image. If you want to, you can add a shadow, so you can see the shadow on the back of your picture and you can scroll down. Now they have some neat free resources here also to work with your image. For, for instance, if you wanted to put somebody you know, put their face in Trump and put it on Facebook to stir up the crowd for great laughs, that's in there. Um, there's also some great backdrops uh, that you can put yourself or somebody else into just sort of like the drop mark. So now we're not concerned with this. We're concerned with this coming down here and if you click this that will make your image transparent. So whatever shape you select up on top here will come to the bottom here. So this is my image and what I want to do is select in the green area and I'm just going to drag this open and I'm going to come to the bottom and click on preview and if I like the shape and the shadow here then I can click done and I could download the image and save it to where I need it and, and I created a folder for a green screen here and I already have a circle so what I'm going to do is cancel that out I'm going to come back up to to the top and I'm just going to click upload and I'm going to choose my photo again and click on go and I'm going to drag out the corners to to round them off and I'm going to add a shadow and I'm going to scroll down I guess you got the idea now and I'm going to select to make it transparent so I can add it to my drop mark uh, image rows. So let me scroll back down and let me drag the green and open it. So it's a simple tool to use. Click on preview. And why that's rounded I don't know. I click this here, come back, and I'll click on preview. And as you can see, so I can keep working with it. There we go. That's something good for me to use. And if you want, you can lose the shadow so you have just the green. 
so I could remove the shadow and I could just click on preview and there's just the green and now I can click done and save it you can find other websites where you can cut out shapes and and use different shapes for your your drop mock images and I'll click to save that and I want to make sure that I'm going to save that in my green screen uh, folder which is becoming like my toolkit and I can save it here There's my new image. So this tutorial was just teaching you to use different shapes to show your video through that you can add through like in, in, in this image here. Um, preview. In this image here I put the circle and I used a video where I spoke through the circle. So let me bring up the video. Um, okay, so I'm on my YouTube channel, and I'll go to the videos real quick, and here is the video animation. Oh my God, hello everybody. Why am I here today? I want to talk to you about bringing your video to life with logo animations. Take a look at some of the animations here and tell me what your thoughts are. You could have video intros, transitions, and video outros to help your business. Whether you have a business for services, events, products, you can have an... So, as you've seen, I used a shape inside of a drop mock image and I used it to get the attention um, naturally uh, a woman or a sports player an athlete anything uh, on this drop mark background I put the circle in there and I was able to add the video behind it and that's what created the uh, video and uh, difference so because it's difference it grabs the attention and that's what I wanted you to see. Thank you for watching this tutorial.